Hi, I'm astronaut Winston Scott. I had the privilege of flying on two space shuttle missions. I spent nine days on Endeavour, then 16 days on Columbia. And uh, I can tell you, like I tell all of my audiences, there is nothing uh, to compare it to here down on Earth. I think everybody knows about the big things we do in space, how we launch and how the shuttle used to re-enter and land, but there are a lot of little things that go on in space that you probably don't know about. I can remember on my first flight, on the flight deck, I was in the Mission Specialist 2 seat in, in the center uh, between the commander and the pilots. I was up on the flight deck and I can remember lying there on my back and watching the clock count down and as we hit seven seconds, uh, you know, the space shuttle main engines begin to ignite. So we're lying there and all this smoke and fire begins billowing up around the windscreen. And just as I'm thinking to myself, aren't we supposed to be going someplace? The clock hits zero, the solid rocket boosters light, and the thing jumps off the pad. When you watch it on TV or on the movies, it seems as though it rises in slow motion. But in reality, it jumps off the pad and sort of kicked me in the butt. It was shaking and vibrating and I was trying to read my gauges and dials and I think um, I whooped the way you do on a Disney ride. I think I actually let like, out a whoop, a yell as we rode uphill because I was having such a good time. And then eight and a half minutes later, we hit orbit. But just the most incredible ride I've had in all of my life. But that's one of the things I always remember about my first flight.